Christine Hardman, and I've been wearing this appliance for probably, what, about three months? And um, I take it out to eat. I found that I couldn't eat with it, um, but I just take it out for a little while, and then I put it back. But the best thing is, um, it took me a while to get used to talk with it, uh, but the best thing is, I wear it all night, and I sleep so much better, and I don't snore. My husband's very happy about that. And I, I get, get up, and I feel rested. I feel like I get a deeper sleep, because I'm, I suppose I'm not in pain, and I'm not, you know, my neck doesn't hurt, and, you know, so that's one thing I really did, discovered that, and he did too said, you know, wow, you don't make any noises anymore. You just lay down and I don't hear a sound coming from you. So, um, things are happening. It's getting better. I'm getting used to wearing it. Good. So. And with you were saying about uh, when you wake up, your neck didn't hurt as much. Right, right, right. It didn't hurt as much. But when when you had it out, when you were, were without it, your neck. Oh, it did. Yeah, when I was without it, yeah, as soon as I'd get up, it would just be like straight up, and you know my neck would be turning this way. And um, I've been told that I don't have extreme torticollis, but you know, I guess I'm vain and I try to you know hide it. So I'll do anything not to show that my neck, but um, I realize that, you know, I, I do some exercise, some yoga exercises that I was given um, when we, when my husband and I attended a symposium on, tw on um, movement disorders, and they were yoga, and one of the things is you slowly move your neck and we kind of get stuck right here. It take a long time to get it to move over that way. So I also, um, you know, I'm trying to incorporate that. You is, know, is it easier with the appliance in? Yes. Yes. That's that's what I yes. mean. Yes. And I went. The other thing is, um, I was surprised to note I um, I've been getting Botox for a long time, every three months, and I saw my neurologist about two or three weeks ago, he was very angry because um, he said, how can you tell if it's going to work when I'm giving you the Botox? So he said, you know, I suggest don't, don't take the Botox anymore, you know, to give this a chance. But he really couldn't understand how it could work. So, um, so I think I'm going to discontinue the Botox. It hurt, uh, and he could never really promise ever, you know, ever a recovery of any sort. It would just be constant Botox every few months. That's the most he could tell. So, um, so I'm really going to give this a shot, and I'm hoping for the best. Do you take EMGs with the Botox? When he would give you the Botox? Huh? Well, he, he just, I asked him, you know, can you tell? And he said, oh, you know, he was just really angry. He's like, oh, I can't tell that much. But, you know, um, in previous times I could really hear it, mm -hmm. you know, making a really loud noise. And, and I looked at the screen a few times and it was just like, <sighs> mm -hmm. you know, so he wouldn't say, he said, I can see a slight decrease. You know, I can feel it in your muscles. Because mm -hmm. he was feeling it all over. So he did notice a s slight decrease, but he was also... Did you see it on the on the EMG machine? I couldn't see it. Oh, okay. They had me facing oh, this okay. way. And he, he had someone in to observe him. You know, another doctor, okay. or maybe a resident. Yes. So... So I guess he felt like a fool when I came in and said, wow, I'm going to do this and that, and, you know, so I don't know. Okay. Well, that's, that's good news. Good news. Yep. But you've seen changes. Yes, I have seen changes. Yes. And how about the, how about the big guy? 
you want me to come into the picture? Oh, tell, tell them what you see, what you have seen. I have noticed a, a change in my wife's uh, uh, condition. She does not seem to uh, require as much medication to alleviate her pain. And uh, she's told me that uh, it, it is uh, definitely having some positive effect on her. I know we're early into the treatment and we don't know the full uh, effect yet, but uh, I think I've noticed an improvement in her condition. Yeah, I've noticed, um, well, people that I work with, too, I work in an office building, and they would always tell me that they could tell when my neck was hurting because it was always like this. And I, I wasn't conscious of it, mm -hmm. you know, and they'd say, oh, Chris, you know, is your neck really hurting you today because your head's sideways? And um, the person that I worked with, that I work with now, said that she's noticed that my head is becoming straighter. It isn't turning as much. I've noticed that also. It's more erect mm -hmm. and um, is not turned to the side as much either. I, I didn't realize it, I guess, because it was such a, That's a slight thing. But, but other people that see me every day, um, they've noticed it. So that's another good positive thing. That's what I like to hear. Good news. Yeah. Good news. Man. We're, we're, we're working toward that, and eventually we'll get there. Yeah, I that's know. our goal. Because before this, there was no goal. Because everyone said, we don't know what to do. You know, there's no cure. Well, you, you got a goal. Right. You got a goal. You right. got a solution in mind. Right. That's right. Right. So and I have another chance. So you see, I, and look at that smile. You see that smile? I love that. That's what I like. Because we know we're headed in the right direction. Right. All right. Cool. So thank you. You're so welcome. Well, Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> a couple days before Christmas. That's all right.